before starting, there might be one entry of this episode of Logo History Collab that would be outdated. Also, if you see three exclamation marks, then turn down your volume. Also also, the person doing this might be, maybe, a bit, dead. Anyways, let's start. Hello YouTube, welcome to Logo History, where we take a look at what the logo was like over the years. Hello everybody. Welcome to the 87th installment of Logo History. Hey guys, it's me, the FedEx Train Alex Fan 2021 here, and welcome to... Fourth episode of Logo History. Papa, hey y'all, hey, welcome everyone to another episode of Logo History. I am Miguel Sanchez. Hello guys, I'm Mitchell and Easy here back in from review. Hello everyone, it's your boy Ruben Garza, and welcome back to the 15th episode of Logo History Collab Entry. Welcome back to another video. And hello everybody. I know it's uh, and welcome to. Um, the, uh, first episode of Logo History Club H3. Welcome to the Logo World UK. I mean, the ninth episode in this series. Hello guys, Kai here and welcome to the tenth episode of Logo History Collab Entry. Hey guys, it's me, Trin the Rainbow Kingdom, FNF 2022 here, doing something new for the Logo History Logopia. What's up everybody, this is Gay Huba and welcome to Logo History. What is up guys? Hey guys, it's me and... Welcome to Logo History. How's it going guys? It's Retro and welcome to Logo Evolution Requested. Guess who's back, 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 back again. Where you request a logo and I'll do it. Hey guys, it's Esther Parias and Sue's Candy Fan here. And today is the next episode of Logo History Clapping. So for this episode, we are doing Nicktoons today. I'm going to talk about Nicktoons. Let's take a look at Nicktoons. And I am here to bring you another Nickelodeon channel that no one has ever, has ever heard of. That's right. We are on episode 84 of the series, and the subject of this episode is Nicktoons! <laughs> oh my gosh, can't wait. Today, um, we are doing Logo Street Part 56. On Nicktoons. Today, I'll be talking about Nicktoons. And today we're going to be doing the logo history of Nicktoons. Today is about Nicktoons. Today it is a channel that airs cartoons by Nickelodeon. Let's show them what it is, boys. Yeah, it's Nicktoons. For this episode, we're going to be taking a look at Nicktoons. For this episode, we're doing Nicktoons from the United States and Canada, which is not to be confused with the brand of the same name. So for this episode, we're going to take a look at Nicktoons. Today's logo history is Nicktoons. Today we're going to talk about Nicktoons. In today's episode, we're going to take a look at a sister channel of Nickelodeon, and it's known as the death penalty of Nick shows. You already know why, and that is Nicktoons. Yes, I know I already covered it on China Bows number 5, but I'm doing Nicktoons for this series because why not? Nicktoons. Nicktoons is the channel that had, that had brought many cartoons by Nick. And ever since, Nicktoons has became popular. Nicktoons is an American pay television channel owned by Viacom CBS Domestic Media Networks. The channel is geared towards children aged 7 to 11, and broadcasts reruns of original animated series from sister network Nickelodeon along with some other animated shows and feature films. 
Let's get started with the show. Does you don't know what Nicktoons is all about? Nicktoons is an American paid television show that's owned by Viacom, CBS, Domestic Media Networks, geared towards children aged 6 to 12. The, the show broadcasts original anime series from sister network Nickelodeon, known as Nicktoons, along with original anime series, some feature films, and foreign anime programs from Nickelodeon's international networks 24 hours a day. If you haven't seen the location on Nickelodeon, definitely go watch it right now. I covered it on episode 25, so if you haven't seen it, go check it out right now. Then come right back to watch it. Anyway, as of September 2018, approximately 56.9 million American households, or 51.3% of households with television, received Nicktoons. Let's take the short program on what the Nicktoons is. It is a TV channel launched in May 1st, 2002. It's owned by Viacom Media Works. Their headquarters are... At New York City, New York. It was formerly called Nicktoons TV, which is 2002 to 2003, and changed to Nicktoons Network to 2000, from 2005 to 2009. Now it's Nicktoons. Its sister channels are Nick, Nickelodeon, <coughs> Nick at Night, Nick Jr., T Nick, and Nick Music. Here's a short bite if you don't know what Nicktoons is. Nicktoons is an American paid television channel owned by Paramount. Now, media networks. The channel is generally towards children aged 7 to 11 and broadcasts reruns of original aimed series from the sister network Nickelodeon, along with some modern anime shows and feature films. Nicktoons also referred to its, to by its former name. Nicktoons is an American Nicktoons network. <sighs> it's an American television network owned by Paramount for the Nickelodeon networks of of its Dominic Media Networks division, launched on May 1st, 2002. The channel mainly broadcasts animated series that are originally known sister network Nickelodeon, known collectively as Nicktoons. Despite its name, however, also it has aired some of the Nick's live, live action series since 2008. So, here's your about this. Nicktoons form the Nicktoons Network. It's an American paid television channel owned by Paramount Networks. The channel is geared towards children aged 7 to 11. And progress re reviews of original anime animated series from Sister Network Nickelodeon, known as Nicktoons, along with some other animated shows and feature films. So, what is Nicktoons? Nicktoons is an American paid television channel owned by Paramount Media Networks. It was founded on May 1, 2002. Nicktoons does not have a job in the logo history on Scratch Blooper series. Nicktoons' partners are Teen Nick, Nick at Night, Nick Mom, Nick Music, and Nickelodeon Movies for Robert's Logo History series. None for Logo History collab, yet, and none for the Logo History on Scratch Blooper series. Here's the short bio if you don't know what Nicktoons is. Nicktoons is an American pay television channel owned by Paramount Media Networks. The channel is geared towards children aged 7 to 11, and broadcasts reruns of original animated series from sister network Nickelodeon along with some other animated shows and feature films. Let's take a look at the short bio, because if you don't know what Nicktoons is, Nicktoons, which is also referred by its former name, Nicktoons Network, is an American television network owned by Paramount Pictures. For the new Nickelodeon Network Society of the Domestic Media Networks Division, launched on May 1st, 2002, the channel mainly broadcasts an animated series that originated on sister network Nickelodeon, known collectively as Nicktoons. Despite its name, however, it also airs a Nick, some of Nick's live action series since 2008. Nicktoons was founded, released in 2002. Nicktoons is an American television network owned by Paramount through Nickelodeon Network subsidiary of its domestic media networks division. Launched on May 1st, 2002, the channel mainly broadcasts animated series that originated on sister network Nickelodeon. Known collectively as Nicktoons, despite its name, however, it has also aired some of Nick's live action series since 2008. You don't know what it is? An American television network owned by Viacom CBS. Speaking of that, I don't really feel like doing the info for Nicktoons again, since I already done the info for it on Channel Battles number. F since I already done the info for it on Channel Battles number five, 
So if you want the info for Nicktoons, go check out Channel Bows number 5. So, here's uh, Nicktoons. The country is the United States. So, so they have got a one person I went to see New York, in the United States. It was all of apparently networks. So, it was launched on May 1st, 2002. So, yeah. So, they're the sister channels. So, these are sister channels. So, Nick and Nordin, Nick and Knight, T Nick, Nick Jr., and Nick and Nick Music. So, as of September 2017, approximately 56.9 million households, 51.3% of households with Kerosene received Nicktoons. Let's go through the evolution of Nicktoons together. Alright. Now I'm going to talk about Nicktoons. All right, let's take a look at Nicktoons. All right, let's not get let's not get crazy about it. Let's jump right into it. The logo history of Nicktoons. Now let's start. But anyways, let's begin the logo history of Nicktoons. And now I'm going to let's begin our let's be let's just let's get started. Now let's start. Now without further ado, let's get started. Also, without further ado, let's get started. And now. Well, let's get on to that episode, shall we? Now let's start. But anyways, let's get straight to the evolution. 2002 to 2003, as you can see, we have a SpongeBob avatar in orange, and on there we have the word Nick, and then we have the words Tunes TV. 2002 to 2003, here we have the first name of Nick Tunes, Nick Tunes TV, on a blue 3D circle. There is an orange silhouette of Spongebob and on him, there is the word Nick in white text and under him, there is the word Tunes in yellow text on a light blue and blue outline and to the right of that, there is a light blue shape on a blue outline and on the shape there is the word TV in white text. 2002-2003, here are the first thing of Nicktoons, Nicktoons TV, it the word Nick, Nick in white text, and an and orange, uh, of, of or, actually looks like Spongebob. On a blue circle inside, and and her her neck there's the word or two. It's a yellow text on uh, on the white blue and you know, dark blue outline. And next to there's a there's a there's just blue writing from her right and the square on a, on a dark blue outline inside the word it's for TV and, and white text. 2002 to 2003, the channel was launched as Nick Two's TV. So we. So we have a uh, SpongeBob square, a little square pants, so let's, and uh, on it, there's a word Nick and white text under it. There's a word tunes and light blue text on a uh, dark blue outline. And uh, on the on the right of the word tunes, there's a uh, dark blue, uh, dark blue, uh, rounded rectangle. And on it, there's a word TV and white text. And I believe that's pretty much it. So, yeah, uh, the blue part, uh, the blue part of the word tunes is still used today, but I'll cover it later on in the video. So, so please stay tuned for that. Anyways, here's the Spongebob variant, the, uh, Tommy variant, the Arnold variant, and the, uh, Angelica variant. 2002 to 2003, we got this Spongebob character, which is <coughs> Spongebob Squarepants himself, which is, or with, which is, he is orange, with the, um, with N Nick in white text, with tunes in blue text, and TV, and white text in this shape. Or outline. 2002 to 2003, the first thing was Nick 2 TV. There was a blue circle inside of it. There was, Spud, there was an orange character, which is SpongeBob, coming out. And inside of it, words Nick and white text on the bottom. There were words Tunes and yellow text on a light blue and dark blue outline. On the right of it, there was a there were words TV. There was a blue square, round and square, on a dark blue outline. Inside of words TV and white text. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to go to the park. 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 I'm going to go
2003. It was first named Nick Tunes, Nick Tunes TV. So Nick Nick Tunes has launched on May 4th, 2002 as Nick Tunes TV. Launching the part of additional cable exclusive entity this suit in keeping with, with the it is friendly of the R is six network. The chance in the additional local Mr. Oish Su Who Lis of of various like little characters, such as SpongeBob SquarePants. Special above. Now there was, there was a Nick and White Tess, and the bottom is his, uh, the orange character. And the red back, that's the circle backward. That's a circle. That's a blue circle. Now, the, now on the bottom, that's both tunes in in uh yellow text and a blue line. So now on the bottom of the light. That's the TV in the right text. Phase 1. Nicktoons TV. 2002 to 2003, and 2021 to the present. We have a blue circle. On it, there's an orange silhouette of SpongeBob. On it, there's the white word Nick. Under the SpongeBob silhouette, there's the yellow word Tunes on a blue shape. On the right of it, there's a blue rounded rectangle with the white word TV. 2002 to 2003. There's a blue gradient circle and on it there's an orange SpongeBob and on it there's the word Nick in white text and under it there's Toons TV in yellow and blue text. First, we start off with Nicktoons TV. 2002 to 2003, Nicktoons was launched on May 1st, 2020. 2002 as Nicktoons TV, originally part of the digital cable exclusive MTV digital suit, in keeping with the identity of its sister network. The channel's international international logo featured original orange silhouettes of various Nickelodeon characters, such as SpongeBob, which is pictured above. So in this logo, we have the blue circle, and inside it, we have an orange SpongeBob with the nicked X in white. And on over here, we have the words tune to TV and blue outline for a yellow and white text with dark blue outline. So, 2002 to 2003, as of Nicktoons TV for the first line, we have Blue's show go on it. And yeah, and this is SpongeBob with uh, arms up and say, I'm money! And this is Nick on white text. And we have tunes with the first outline with bright blue and darkest blue. And then there was TV and white text instead of yellow. And then it's just this Nick who comes out almost. Anyway. 2000 to 2003, we have a blue circle. And inside of it, we have an orange SpongeBob. Also, we have tunes in yellow text and TV in white text. 2003 to 2004, there is a, the word Nick on white text. And, uh, and behind it, there's a SpongeBob orange spongebob and behind the orange spongebob there's a blue circle and under it there's the word tunes tv in yellow and uh, and white text 2002 to 2003 nicktoons was launched as a channel as nicktoons tv and this scene is probably going to be a little long, so get ready. Below them, we had the word tunes in yellow text with two outlines in different shades of blue. And next to that, we have the abbreviation TV in white text in a blue rounded shape with a darker blue outline. Told you this scene is long, am I right? So, 2003, there's this silhouette, there's a silhouette SpongeBob, and on there's wood Nick in white text, and on there's a wood Tunes TV. I'm not gonna tell you explain it, cause it's too much time.
2003 to 2004, they changed its name to Nicktoons. There is a white splat on an orange outline and on the splat, there is the word Nicktoons in orange text. 2003 to 2004, he wrote the first, his second name Nicktoons. Nicktoons, that is the first era. Here's a, or, a white spot on, on the orange outline inside like there's word in, in, it's word Nicktoon. Here's an orange text. 2003 to 2004, they changed its name to Nicktoons. There was a white splat on an orange outline instead of a word. No one wants Nick Toons in orange text. 2003 to 2005, 2003 to 2004. We have, we have the famous splat with it in orange, and it's surrounded in the in like one of the old Nick Toons logos. We have an orange with, with a white spot with an orange outline. On April 7, 2003, the channel's name was shortened to Nicktoons and it's, and it's adopted a logo similar to that of the namesake brand outfit using the 1998 Nickelodeon splat. Now, 2003 to 2004, it was changed to Nicktoons. So you got the Nicktoons and orange text. So inside the white spot in, in the all in the orange outline. Sorry. On April 7, 2003, the channel's name was shortened to Nicktoons, and and up adopt a lo local similar to that. Uh, all this New sick friend Albert using the, the 1998 Nick Sprat. Phase 2, Nicktoons Part 1, 2003 to 2004. We have a white splat. On it, there's the orange word Nicktoons. 2003 to 2005. There's the orange 2D splat, and on it, there's the word Nicktoons in orange text. Now for this, we start with Nicktoons for the first era. 2003 to 2004. We have a uh, orange spot, which is somehow white for some reason, with orange outline, and inside it we have the word Nicktoons in orange text. For our April 17, April 7, 2003, the channel's name was shortened to Nicktoons. It adopted the logo similar to that of its namesake brand, I've been using the 19. E98 Nick Lyons plot. 2003 to 2004, as of Nick Tunes, first area and second area. After the Nick Tunes, we move on to the second area. Right now, it's first area. Again, 2003 to 2004, we have white spread with orange outline, and we have Nick Tunes and orange text. 2003 to 2005, and 2003 to 2004. We have a white splat with an orange outline, and inside of it, we have the word Nicktoons in orange text. 2003 to 2004, Nicktoons TV has been shortened to just Nicktoons. And now we have a white splat with an orange outline. Inside of it is the word Nicktoons in orange text. 2003 to 2004, we got an orange splat, and on it there's the word Nicktoons in orange text. 2003 to 2005, we have a white splat with the blue, with the word Nicktoons in blue. Similar to the previous logo, the splat is in 3D and the Nicktoons is different. <laughs> 2004 to 2005, the logo is now chrome in blue. 2004 to 2005, the text is now in blue text and and that's why it sounds silver. 2003 to 2005, they changed the name to Nicktoons, so we have uh, a silver splat, and on it there's a word Nicktoons in blue text. Also, the logo is 3D. You see? I'm okay. Um, here's an early version from 2003 to 2004 uh, via on-screen bug for daytime and the on-screen bug for nighttime. 2003 to 2005, we got um, the Nick splat, but it's like metal kind. I don't know what it is, but. No, excuse me, I've been <coughs> eating some root beer and pet pretzels, so yeah. <coughs> Anyways, 
2003 to 2005, we got this, um, splat, but it's not orange, it's, like, orange, not orange, but it's, like, metal stuff, and, or it's glossy, so, and we have the Nicktoons, the Nicktoons text, which is in blue, with, um, black drop tail. It's except for the T. So, I was a 4 to 2005, now, now the splash, the light blue and a light blue outline, on white outline. The chrome finish inside of it, and then in the text of the word Nicktoons is now blue. Then four to two thousand five, we have Nicktoons in a blue slash purple, in the gray spot, which is kind of three D. March two thousand four, the logo was redone to have a chrome finish, with the world mark being changed to blue. Just around to, to June two thousand five, the channel began to carry regular advertising, and now was the Offered on digital satellite television along with digital cable. Just roll to number five. That's what uh, that's what Nick does. In a change of color, it's a change of color to blue, and about the there's the spread color change. In March two thousand four, the logo was begun to have a cool fish finish with with the more begin change to blue. Around two, two, 2005, the trip began to carry regular analyzing and, and was now often turned on digital satellite television along with digital cable. 2004 to 2005, the splat became 3D and the word Nicktoons was recolored to blue. 2004 to 2005, there's a great bluish 3D splat and on it there's the word Nicktoons in blue text. 2004 to 2005, the logo was redone to have a chrome finish. The same here is that it's now having a queer outline outfit. Due to this, we had the word Nicktoons in blue. The logo was redone to have a chrome finish with the word mark being changed to blue. Around 2005 on June, the channel began to carry regular advertising and now was offered on digital satellite television along with digital cable. And also 2004 to 2005, this is the Blee 3D Splat with uh, water and we have Nicktoons and Doggis blue text. And this is a uh, blue-ish and white outline. 2000 for 2, 2005. It's the same thing, but the Nicktoons is in blue text, and the splat is shiny and bright cyan. 2004 to 2005, there were the silver splats in the 3D effect, and be and then front of it, there's a word. Jeez. 2004 to 2005. Now we have a light blue splat with a chrome effect. Inside of it is the word Nicktoons in dark blue text. 2004 to 2005. Now this one is gray. And now it's now Nicktoons and now blue text. 2005 to 2009. Um, we have like it appears to be a glow with um uh, with a splat on it. And, and it has the words Nicktoons Network. 2005 to 2009, here we have the third name of Nicktoons, Nicktoons Network. There is an orange globe with an orange splat and under it, there are the words Nicktoons and Network in orange text. 2005 to 2009, here is the third, it changed the name to Nicktoons Network. I have a I have an orange globe covered by, by orange paint, and under are the words Nicktoons and Network. In orange text. Um, 2005 to 2009, the huge name again, this time as Nick Tunes Network. So we have a, uh, the, we have an orange globe, and coming up from the right of the globe, we have an orange splat, tripping all, tripping from the left, from the right all the way up to the left. It is, oh, I, 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 and this splatty globe is called the Splat Globe.
<laughs> it's fun. Anyway, it's under this black globe, which I really love it. Uh, there are the words Nick Toots and Network and Orange Text, but uh, with both words being in different fonts. So, I love it. Here's the ice cream bot, the version with their slogan, not just cartoons, Nick Toons. And their war mark. 2005, 2009, we got this, um, Earth, or this <coughs> global Earth, with the splat. We got the text Nicktoons Network in orange. 2005, 2009, they changed its name to Nicktoons Network. There is an orange globe inside of it. There's actually an orange slime. And on the bar, where it's Nicktoons Network in orange text in different fonts. Nicktoons Network, 2005 to 2009. We have Nicktoons in orange. Network in orange. We have a weird earth covered in, in orange with, like, orange slime. Oh, September 23, 2005. The channel was relaunched on its Nicktoons network with a new on air graphics package created by Exopolis. Life 2005 to 2009. It they'll change the name to Nicktoons Network. Now on the button, that's with the network in those checks. Now on the button, that's the circle is the spread of that group. Also, what the heck is that? That's a line here, that is a spread. It's the determination of the world. On September 23, 2005, the channel has been launched as Nick Teens Network with a new on air graphics package created by Exopolis. Phase 3 Nick Tunes Network 2005 to 2009 and 2021 to the present. We have a weird circle with lines and it has been splatted. Under it, we have the orange words Nicktoons and Network. 2005 to 2009. There's an orange splat globe and under it there's the word Nicktoons Network in orange text. Now we then go to Nicktoons Network. 2005 to 2009. We include an orange swan globe. And below that, we have the word Nicktoons Network in orange text. For September 23rd, 2005. The channel is relaunched as Nicktoons Network, with a new on-air graphics package created by x Polis. 2005 to 2009, the third line is Nicktoons Network. We have Nicktoons and Owens text with the 1984 Nickelodeon and Network. Just like, I think, Owens text with front, I guess. And there's a globe with the splat moving the fan. And wow, just goes look at it. And looks like, hey, how cool is that? How is that? How is that? Two thousand five to two thousand nine, we have a globe. And on the right of it, we have orange paint or Nickelodeon slime. And we have Nicktoons Network in orange text. 2005 to 2009. There's a... A globe with that... Is, and left and right to it, there's a... Orange flat and be and down there this with Dick Tunes Network and Orange Tech. 2005 to 2009. Dick Tunes changed its name back to Nick Tunes Network. Now we have an orange globe with orange slime covering half of it. And not gonna lie, I, I really like this. No seriously, I do. Anyways, below the globe, we have the words Nicktoons Network in orange text. 2009, 2009, and now there's a globe, and under it there's the word Nicktoons Network, and 
in orange text. 2009 to the present. Uh, this is the look we're going to see today. We have the word Nick and an orange text on the right. There's the word tunes and black text. And that's it. The same about this logo. Um, here's the print version and the version where the word tunes is in yellow text on a black outline. And it was used on some international variants. So, since 2014. So, yeah, keep that in mind. 2009 to 2014. This is where... This is where all channels made by Nick align with the current Nickelodeon logo. Um, we have the word Nick in orange and the word Tunes in red. Also, we they have their HD logo where the word Tunes is in gray. 2009 to 2014, they finally changed its name to Nick Tunes. There are the words Nick and Tunes in orange and red text. Two, 2009 to 2014. And he changed him back, back again to Nicktoons. So there's a word for Nicktoons too. It's an orange, orange, and, orange and red text. 2009 to 2014, now the word Toons is in red text, and that's all there is to it. This is the original logo of Nicktoons, so yeah, that's good. Um, Here is the 3D version. 2009, 2009 to 2014, we got. The, this is like the. um. <coughs> This is like, um, when it, it becomes, like, the rest of the Nicktoon logos, of the Nick logos, so, we got the word Nick in, as orange as always, and we got the word Toons in red with the trademark. 2009 to 2014, they changed its name back to Nicktoons, there are the words Nicktoons in orange and blue red text. Nicktoons, second era. We went 2009 to the present. In 2009-2014, we have Nick in orange and tunes in, like, red something. This is more, like, of the Nick's, Nick, uh, Teen Nick logo. September 28, 2009, the channel re reverted to its former name and adopted a logo model after its sister's network's new introduced redesign. Now, Tinos 2014 that's where Nick is on stacks. Now that it's like, then we'll change your Nick, Nick Toons again. That's the word, all, that's Nick in all stacks. And now about on the right, that's where the tunes in red text. On September 28, 2009, Patel revert to his final name and a double to logo logo after his sister networks. Newly introduced with the redesign. Phase 4, Nicktoons Part 2, 2009 to 2014. We have the orange and red word Nicktoons. 2009 to 2014. There's the Nick logo, and next to it, there's the word Tunes in red text. Now for Nicktoons Second Era, 2009 to 2014. The channel reverted to its former name and adopted a logo model after its sister network's newly introduced redesign. 2009 to 2004, we say goodbye to the Nicktoons network and farewell to Nicktoons second area. This has been a fourth line. Again, 2009 to 2014, we have Nick and Orange text and the red is in tunes and red who is it nick and orange and red is tunes 2009 to the present in 2009 to 2014 we have nick and orange text and tunes and red text 2009 to 2014 the nick that's a the font has been changed and the globe and then the word that work has been removed and uh, now the tunes are in red text 2009 to 2014 as part of Nick's universal rebrand Nicktoons network changed its name back to Nicktoons and there's not much stuff to cover in this logo just the one Nick and orange text with the word tunes and red text next to it 2019 there's the word Nicktoons Orange red text. 2014 to 2016, we have the word tunes in chartreuse or in light green. 
All right. Um, and we also have their HD logo. Sorry if you can't clearly see it, but it says Nicktoons HD. 2014 to 2016. The word tunes and now in lime green text. 2014 to 2016. Is now in light green text. 2014 to 2016. Now the word tunes is in lime green text. The, the in order to go with Nick Tunes' new on-air graphics for graphics package. So yeah, if you know if you know if you're looking for action to the max John, you know where to go. Nick Tunes. 2014 to 2016. Same thing here, but the tunes in a trademark changed into like a greenish color. 2014 to 2016. The now the word tunes is now in light green text. 2014 to 2016. As of February 2022, we have just same as last time, but the Nick, but the uh, but the tunes is in like slime color. As of February 2022, this is still used on some bumpers. Nick will be right back. 2014 to 2016. And hold on. That's what Nick in orange checks. Now the bottom of the white. That's what tunes in green checks. So what should I show you about? This is what tunes in green checks. Why is that trademark? Sorry, sorry. Trademark. As of, as of February 2022, this is still used on some bubbles. 2014 to 2016, the tunes part was recolored to somewhere between green and yellow. 2014 to 2016, the word tunes in light green. 2014 to 2016, as of February 2022, this is still used on bumpers. The reason would be still here, but except the tunes word is now green. 2014 to 2016, same here, but there's only tunes letter different with the... A uh, lime? 2014 to 2016. It's the same thing, but the tunes is in lime green. 2007 to 2006. Damn! Well, that was way off. We had a... There it... The... What? The color of the tunes is now green. And here we go with these boring color changes again. 2014 to 2017, the word tunes changed its color to a limeish color. 2014 to 2017, the, the word tunes is now green. Um, 2016 to the present, the word tunes is in, is in light blue instead of red or light green. And we also have their HD logo. 2016 to the present. The word tunes is now blue. 2016 to the present. That word tunes is in, is in blue text. And finally, 2016 to the present. The word tunes is now in uh, blue text. Same as last time. Except, the, again, the word tunes is now in blue text. And that's that's it. That's all I gotta say. Here's April Fool's Day version, the uh, Earth Day version, the Summer version, and the Christmas version. 2016 to the present, we got... Um, the same thing, but the tunes te and trademark symbol and text is now blue. And 2016 to the present, now the word tunes is now in blue, light blue text. Same as the other two, but the Nick actually looks darker, and it's the tunes is blue. As of November 2014, 16. As of November 14, 2016, well, tune had its color changed again, this time to blue. And finally. 2016 to the present. Uh, okay. uh, so now, now the tunes like change the color. So on November 14, 2016, the world tunes had its color change again. It's time to move. 2016 to the present. 
The tunes part was recolored to blue. 2016 to the present, the word tunes is blue. 2016 to the present, the word tunes had its color change again, this time to blue. And last but not least, 2016 to the present, tunes has changed from um, lying to cyan. 2016 to the present, it's the same thing but the tunes is in cyan. 2016 to the present, the tunes text is now blue. And finally, 2017 to the present, the word tunes changed its color again. But this time, the word is now in blue. 2016 to the present, the word tunes is now blue. So that is all for now. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Logo History. And I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new episode. Stay tuned for episode 20, Nickelodeon Movies. Bye bye Alright, that was it for today's episode, but stay tuned for episode 88, episode 7 of Notable Logos, where I'm going to talk about Mac OS, M6, Discovery Family, Google, Discovery, and Wild Brain. And until the next one, bye. Alright guys, this is it for this episode of Logo Histories. Stay tuned for the next one. Stay tuned for episode 45. Nick to Nick Nick Jr. T Nick Mario Party 1 Mario Game and Mario Party 2. Bye for now. Alright, thank you so much for watching this episode of Local History. Don't forget to like like this video, share it, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that we use it up it's a single video. Uh, I believe that's pretty much it for now. Uh, yeah, but I really love it. All right, thanks again for watching. I'm going to such a good result, and I'll see you next time for another new episode of Logo History. Please do not forget that Logo History always is really is the easy decision you'll make all day. So please do come back and see us get real soon for episode 85, where it's going to be about Cozy TV. You did not want to miss this, and I hope you will too. We'll see you for episode 85. Very soon on Cozy TV for everyone here on Local History. I am you guys, Hedges. I'm signing off the air, and I'll see you next time for another episode of Local History. I'll see you for episode 85 very soon on Cozy TV. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Laters. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Did smash the like button, subscribe, and comment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. To stay tuned for part 57 on Double After Effects. Oh boy. Alright, that's about it. So stay tuned for episode 16 for next episode. But anyways, this is Rangor the signing off and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Thanks guys for watching. So here are the so here are the events. Tina! Ha ha ha! Please don't leave a like, comment, and subscribe to your channel. And I'll see you next episode. Guys, and stay tuned for the local YouTube and stay tuned for the next episode of this country. So, this is. So, this is between sides sign off. And I'll see you in the next video. If we're not going to do this, we're not scared. So, bye. Well, that's it. If you want to know why I look dead. Here's this song cover. <laughs> and that's why I look dead. Anyways, rest in peace zombie pigman, and goodbye. Meanwhile, somewhere else. Ha 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 ha. You're now in. Wherever the heck we're in. Wait, you don't actually know. I don't think anyone knows. Oh, uh, uh hey Peter John. Shut up. Now for my evil plan. <laughs> Meanwhile, with Touchstone Pictures. I felt a great
great disturbance in the force. Okay guys this is it for today. Stay tuned for the next episode. Until next time bye. Alright so that's it for now guys. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Logo History Logo P. Don't forget to comment down below for more requests on Logo History Logo P. If you're saying about this, I'll see you in a future day. Alright, see you later guys and bye for now. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. That's all for now for Logo History. I created Logo History just just like from this after this uh for 38 pause act of Logo History collab on June 4, 2022. And it's on form for the description and uh, history local collab and 39. And we see the form will be in the description. Yeah. So so I'll see you in the next collab when this next episode comes. And the Alex section will be count down and say goodbye in five, four, three, two, one, zero. Bye-bye! All right. That's it for now, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Logo History, and I will see you guys soon for number six. Hi, this feature me, and I just wanted to say that you're probably wondering, why did I use text-to-speech? It's because I recorded my voice with my headphones, and the voice didn't come out on my headphones. So sorry! Okay, I'll see you guys later for number six. Okay, guys, thanks for watching, and see you next time, and stay tuned for episode Two, which will be Cubo. But anyways, that's going to be it for this episode of Logo Evolution Requested. Make sure to request the logo you want me to do in the next episode. And if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more quality content. But until next time, this is Retro Galaxy signing out. Okay, thank you guys for watching. Also this. No LG for number two! Okay, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe and see you in the next episode. Bye.